Today I wanted to show you how to replace a uh, windshield wiper switch on a 97 Honda Civic. I've already taken the steering column cover off <clears throat> just so I can show you that um, it's got these plastic tabs on here and so when you're taking it apart you don't want to just rip it apart because you'll break them. You kind of want to push it in and pull up on that and it'll pop right off and on the bottom there's uh, <clears throat> three Phillips screws that go right here on the bottom. So you just need a screwdriver to take those off. It's really easy. And then turn your key so you could turn your steering wheel. And then on your windshield wiper switch itself, there's two Phillips screws right here. I've already kind of loosened them just to make the video go quicker. So you just take those out. And just as a precaution, if your car has an airbag, you wanna disconnect your battery and leave it sitting for about 30 minutes before you do any kind of work around your your uh, steering column because if this airbag goes off and you're sitting still it can kill you. So after you get those two screws out it just pops out like that. Sometimes they stick and so you could take your flat blade screwdriver if it sticks and just kind of put it in right there and, and pop it out. Now <clears throat> on the back of your switch there's just one plug. You just push this little clip in and pull it out. Sometimes that sticks also. So you could just take your Phillips screwdriver right there and pop it out. Then just grab your new switch. Pop that back on. Slide it back in. Grab your screws. Tighten that down. And I got this switch online from a company called Parts Train. I've gotten quite a few items from them over the past 10 years. And I've never had a problem. It was, uh, I think, $45. And now if you take this to the dealership to have them replace it, you're probably looking at a bill close to $200 by the time everything's done. So, and then you just pop these back on, put your screws back in, and you're done. 